welcome to the next episode of Hoarder House to Home. In this episode, it's all about the basement. We've hired a remediation company to come in and solve all the water problems with the basement. They're going to start by sanitizing the rafters, the walls, and the floor with a some kind of hydrogen peroxide solution. And then they're going to be digging out a trench all along the outer perimeter and putting in drain tile and their patented drain system. And then they're going to be installing a second sump pump for everything to run into. And they're gonna be tying in all the gutters to drainage system outside as well and it's all gonna run off out the back of the property. Today I'm gonna to start the first project by installing some uh, hard, rigid foam insulation up along the top of the block on the perimeter uh, where the sill plate is, there's actually about three inches of block that's exposed on the top on the inner, inner perimeter and it's actually open to the space that's inside of the block. And this is allowing critters like snakes a way to get in and out of the house and it's also allowing moisture to evaporate up through the block and call it, bring odor into the house and moisture. So I'm going to start by sealing that off uh, by cutting the foam into strips and gluing it in place. That way it's ready to go on Monday for when the basement company shows up. All right, well, it's Monday morning. The first day of work on the basement has officially begun. The crew got here about 8.30, and they've started jackhammering out the perimeter of the basement wall. They're going to put off the cleaning and sanitizing for another day. They wanted to get straight to demolition today.
that's all there is for day one. They completed the excavating on the, along the perimeter, all the way around the basement. The only thing we had to disconnect was the water heater. It's been disconnected and it's going to be thrown out and replaced anyway. hollow here and then we'll do one in the joint right here in the mortar joint.
right, so day two completed. Today was a very productive day for the crew. As you can see they got not only the channeling done, they cored out all the drainage holes in the block and then they got this finished wall covering installed on here. Basically it's a vapor barrier and a finished look. Uh, they still have to put new cutouts for windows and they're also going to be replacing the windows with a glass block. And then the electrician came and ran in a second outlet over here a new circuit for the sump that's going here really does brighten it up down here all right we are here day three of the basement waterproofing job looks like they're getting started down in the basement with laying in the pipe in the trench they made and we'll see what else the day brings. They're going to try to get most of it wrapped up today and tomorrow. That way hopefully they don't have to come out Friday. the end of day three and today they got all the channel the new water channel laid and both sump pumps are roughly installed here's where the new one goes out through the wall Serious system here. This Blue Angel Gemini battery backup charger. See if we got some kind of Wi Fi module that'll let you know if there's something wrong with the system. Outside, got more of the channel dug. You can see where it's gonna go out here and exit the yard back over the hill and then instead of having the sump pipe exit way up here which makes no sense they relocated it down here it'll come out go into the ground exit down over the hill here we are on the other side of the house they've dug a channel under the deck where everything will come and join together here this is the other sump pump and then we'll run out over the hill. So it looked like they had another productive busy day. I think for the first time since I've been down in this basement it doesn't stink and it actually smells good. All right it's Thursday first decent day of spring got nice weather today and ready to get started finishing up this basement waterproofing project.
Oh, it's the end of day four, Thursday, and the job is completed. We've got the spray foam in the rafters, new windows, the wall system, perimeter drainage system has been installed, secondary sump pump, dehumidifier. We have some drains plumbed in over here, one for the dehumidifier, one for the furnace, which I just connected. So we can get rid of that condensate pump. We'll just gravity drain. And of course, outside, all the gutters were tied in and drain out over the side of the hill. This was the last major project that needed to be completed with the house. The other one being the HVAC system. Now it's just finishing all the other little things like the kitchen and the bathroom and the flooring. Please like and subscribe if you enjoyed, and we'll see you next time. Thanks.